and this place also seems like you have some really nice uh, pokeballs. Maybe tomorrow. Wow, check this cute stall. It's called Swir Swirkies. I wonder if they have any vegan stuff. Let's see. Unfortunately, they didn't add any vegan cookies, but the place itself was so pretty. It had like poles made of uh, flowers. Very nice. Pizza Bogalels. Really nice. Italian pizza connection. Okay, found a super right here. It's called Great Rose. So green. They have in the produce section. So this is the vegetables. Gosh, Britain really like the plastic. So much plastic. But they do give you the whole broccoli here. In Israel, they cut them. They have. So they have your mushrooms. Interesting mushroom. Natura organic shiitake. This is the king oyster or forest mushroom. Here they have grapes. Oh, that's nice. They have a mix of uh, three different colors. They have kiwis. The only thing with no plastic. What is those? <laughs> how cute. Look how precious are the avocado. They really take care of their avocado. And bananas. Is this red banana or two ripe banana? <laughs> And dates. And on this side, they have blueberries and strawberries. This looks good actually. Strawberries. Gosh, they look so good. And berries. Each strawberry looks like a model. Here yeah, they have dragon fruit, passion fruit, and even a Oh, and this I know from uh, Thailand. Oh, that is a cute package. And finally, no plastic. And the uh, apples. Most of them look green, not yellow. I only like yellows. And I think this is papaya. Okay, so that was the food section. So here is the cake section. Oh, they're so cute looking. Oh, this is adorable. Probably not vegan yet, but adorable design. I think all of those are body cake. I feel too lazy to bake the little kid. Oh, they even have a unicorn. Again, I'll give you a quick look on the biscuits and cookies. So that's cool, I just noticed they have a mark to tell you if it's uh, vegetarian or vegan. Like we have a vegan, like we have the vegan friend this time, so they have this tip. And if it's also vegan, it tell you. So this is vegan, 
some of them are only vegetarian, as you can see. Yeah, so look for the monk. <laughs> this is an interesting kind of bread. It looks like Ethiopian bread. I think this is one of the classic British sweets, but unfortunately it has milk inside. Not too many sweets that are vegan, as you can see. what I found, those kittens candy. I tried them already, well I tried the Christmas version and I know all of them vegan. So this is the version I had, just uh, was written Christmas on it, very very good. But this time I'm gonna take the small size. Oh, actually I see they have a discount on the big one, so you know what? I'm actually gonna take the big one. Yes, join those. And I also noticed they have some vegan marshmallow. They have strawberry and they have vanilla. That's it. Quite hard finding the vegan stuff here. So when you find one, you take them. These are, but they're quite expensive. So it does seem that there's some big construction. More than half of the supermarket is closed. Let's find some more snacks there and that's it. So I found all the plant-based milk section. They have a lot of Alpro and this brand that I never saw before, Root brand. And this one is funny. I like the drawing. And this one as well, Gilda. Okay, so I found this old section, this and this, the mono snacks that are vegan. First, I wasn't sure because it's a dairy gluten, but when you read it, it's a vegan and free from, so it's quite misleading if you only read this one. Which one shall I take? Fruit, caramel, of course. Caramel and sea salt. This one looks tasty. Okay, and this is the snack section. Look at the size of them, they're huge. This will last me for the whole trip. Oh, the small sizes. Okay, I think this is not for now. Some observation I noticed. I don't think uh, London have a lot of garbage cans, so most of the house just put their garbage outside like this in a bag. Okay, it's almost 8 p.m. right now. To be honest, I'm quite tired. Uh, it took me a while in the supermarket because it's so hard to find the vegan product. Only a few of them are marked with uh, beef or vegan. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna head back to the hostel. I think I'm gonna rest. And yeah, I guess this is gonna be it for today. So if you like, please leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you on the second day. Okay, so here is my bounty from today. One sec, I'll go back. And that I got from the duty free, the prolinium that carry my name, the Karina, all of the kittens, the vegan kittens, uh, those two vegan marshmallows, strawberry and vanilla, this barbecue uh, corn fries, and those chocolate. I have here mono, I think I saw this brand before, and this one as well.